what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have uh, rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary. But the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing around the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. So it's away we go then. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Hugo Lloris. His lightning fast reactions and all round shot stopping ability make him a formidable obstacle for opposition strikers. And you'd always back him, Peter, in a one on one. He doesn't just stick to his penalty area though, he dominates the. And he has been fouled there. Not taking him long, and that's going to be a booking. And the players are making their point, but the ref clearly isn't interested. He's waved them all away. That was travelling. And it's played forward. Deli Ali. And here's Son Hyung Min. He's tried one. Great strike. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong, make them right. Forward it goes. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Lucas Mora. Now it's Lucas Moura. The keeper's ball. Big chance! An absolute thunderbolt! About as smooth as it gets! Tottenham are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's their clever use of counter-attacking. That's the real highlight. Tottenham break the deadlock. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Here's the cross. Sanchez can get it clear. Hoiberg tries to get it forward quickly. Played towards the front then. That's clear cut. It's a free kick. And that has been. 
Smith. Dyer. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what are they trying to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Dama Traore. Drives it towards the front. Deli Ali. Winks plays it forward. Raul. Goes for goal! Oh, that's a fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Oh, smart save. Son Hyung Min plays it out to the flank. So who's he picking out? That'll be a throw in. Gorgeous control there. He's gone for it! And in it goes! Two up now, and they are cruising. What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. So that's two now without reply. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Ruben Neves gets it back. And it's Adama Traore. Yeah, that does look a foul. If he's given a free kick. And he's going to Rex. Sanchez. A decent effort as the first half draws to a close. So first half courts. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position. So why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done, but that will be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. Herva. into the middle and it's hoisted clear get that clear they've got it back as soon as they gave it away Joel Moutinho looking cross field changing the point of attack 
Ruben Neves. Ruben Neves goes up and over. Hoiberg. And it's Son Kyung Min. Beautifully done. Well, it has crossed the line, and it's a play. Ruben Nevers drives it forward. Xiao Moutinho out to the right. Lucas Moura absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. You have to admire a commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Dyer gets into the right position to intercept. Sanchez. Hoists it forward. quickly oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger Jimenez gets into a dangerous position Deli Ali this game seems as if it's going to go beyond a rescue point uh, so they need a goal and fast just to raise spirits and at least give their fans something to cheer Ruben Neves, and it's played forward, done very well to intervene. Hoiberg. Dyer. Dyer drives it forward. Ricky Lon. Now it's Son Hyung Min. And that's it. Well, the players certainly gave it everything but just didn't get the break. Terrific support, terrific effort, but the wrong outcome. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Wolverhampton could still be playing Peter and probably still be trying to score. It might just be causing some edginess for the camp. Well, thanks for your company, Jim, and a very good day to you.